Hi, I'm Luke Bannister, aka Banny UK, Mountain Dew sponsor pilot. Drone racing is an exciting and fast growing sport. We push ourselves to the limits and we push our gears to the limits. Each competition has a different set of specifications and we're constantly innovating to match those specifications or exceed them. Last year I won a few events, you know, World Drone 3, PR1, DCL. Those are absolutely insane and I'm hoping this season is going to be even better. I'm here in Manhattan, New York. We're here with Mountain Dew and DR1 doing some promotional stuff. Uh, with Sean Terry as well. My name is Mac Oswald, aka Mac FPV. I'm a pilot for Nextblade. This season is really looking amazing. We're going to race Isle of Man and the racetrack will consist of some of elements from the tracks from uh, TT, motor racing. And one of the locations here, they're building in Bonn, Germany. It's a really massive building and I think that we're going to dive the building. It's going to be first of a kind. I don't do just only drone racing, I do freestyle, I also do aerials and photography. Now this isn't your usual drone just floating around in the sky, I get in there and I chase things. For example, I've filmed skiers, I've flown through cars, I've chased cars around tracks, and I'm hoping with this season I can do more of that. So a normal drone is flown by line of sight, whereas our drones are flown by FPV, which stands for first person view. And this means that the video from the drone is transmitted back to our goggles with a receiver where we view it. So it's like sitting inside of the drone. My favorite places to fly are places where there's trees, where there's gaps, where you can make a race course out of natural obstacles. The abandoned location was so much fun to fly. It had all the different elements that you'd expect in a racetrack. We went there with some extremely talented pilots. We had Mac, who's fast and smooth. Sean Taylor was there, like ultimate champion of every league. Juicy Johnny was there. Kane was there, insanely fast kid. The racetrack started with a huge dive through the trees. Up and over, down through this gap, shooting up this way to the right of these trees. And then after that tree, we went for a, a massive power loop. The whole tree. Power loop, all the trees. Then we went through a door, this doorway here, onto the street, punching through a window. We're going to go through here. We are going to come through this window here. Yeah. Then went through the window, came back to the window with the chicane. Then did a corkscrew through windows. Come through this and then just shoot straight up. And that'll be a lot. It was so much fun to fly. My best tip to go from rookie to pro is start with something durable and affordable. Look, I hit the wall. And then once you master those, then start looking on YouTube to build videos, parts you need to build the drones we fly, and then you'll be there in no time. Drone racing is the ultimate freedom. It's so much fun. It's to do with your friends, to do in racetracks instead of a course anywhere. It's epic.